Hi guys! So as I told you guys, I am or was going to make another video and I am really going to try to get better at this. So as you can see, I made a video probably like what, three days ago and I am here with yet another video. So yeah, I have my tie head on. We have this big gala for my job tomorrow, so I'm washing my wig. <laughs> Hence, I have this tie head on. So yeah, I hope it doesn't offend anybody. But anywho, um, this is about all the emails that I've been getting, guys. So I know you guys send me a lot of thank yous and you know that I've been very helpful and all of that stuff. But guys, I want to tell you thank you. Like, thank you for bringing me on this journey with you guys. You know, thank you for even believing or trusting my advice, you know. Thank you guys. Like I know doing this surgery, it is a big, like, oh my God, you know? And when you don't have a support system or you don't know anybody who has experience or is willing to, to help you with knowledge about the procedure, I know that is super frustrating. So I see, you know, where I could be of a big help to you guys, but at the same time, I am starting a business and you guys have been extremely helpful. Thank you guys for everybody who is buying the packages and i do hope that you know you guys do enjoy the package and you do realize that you know it's a big help so thank you a million you know i am very open to feedbacks you know i do understand that you know i might not please every single body but i am here to make that right you know um so yeah guys thank you so much like you don't even understand. That's why I tried my best to reply to every single email that I possibly can with whatever advice. You know, guys. So thank you guys so much for your support. Um, so as I told you, um, I'm trying to do this video on different, different topics. And my first topic, guys, will be being single for the holiday season, which I'm going to do another video. This is just a thank you video, guys. You know? Um, so I want to touch on a little thing with one of the packages that I sell, got sold guys. So I get that not everybody will be coming to Miami to do their surgery. A lot of people will be going abroad. Um, so guys, when you go abroad, right, when they see you coming with everything, you know what they're going to try to do? Tell you that, oh, the one that you have is not the right one. Do, I'm a science major in school. Perfect example, ibuprofen. And um, what brand now? So you have three different brand ibuprofen. So you have like a cheap brand ibuprofen. So you have an expensive brand ibuprofen. And so you have a middle brand ibuprofen. See? There's a specific component that makes up ibuprofen. And for it to be called ibuprofen, that means all of the components are there. The only different guys is probably like the coating or the damn company. Okay, guys? So don't listen to what they have to, to tell you. Like, you come down with a garment, right? They're going to be like, damn, normally people don't come with garments. I was supposed to make the money off of that. So you know what they're going to try to do? Tell you a million and one things why the garment that you have is not good. Listen, I'm an islander. I'm a Jamaican. Jamaican. Most islanders, they're hustlers. Okay, guys? Hustlers. They will let you, they will sell a blind person at TV. They could sell a deaf person a radio. That's Islanders, okay? Anyways, so yes, guys. So apart from that, um, another thing I want to talk to you guys about. You see, if you decide you want to do the surgery, sweetheart, you go right ahead and do the surgery. You don't listen to naysayers or anything like that because let me tell you something. You see, if they could have done the surgery or had the money to do the surgery, they would have gone right ahead and do the surgery. That's one. Number two, you see when you come out to your body, up, oh, up oh, Jamaican, English meaning, you look, you look good. You know what? They're the same one who's going to be like, you know, some shit, Jamaican again. You know, I must speak it in Jamaican and then English. You know, some, you know, some want to do and stuff like that, how it go? Or in English, you'll be like, you know, I should have done it or I'm thinking about doing it now. You see, when you go in front of that mirror, it's your body. You see what you see. You see if or when you try on that jeans with your love 
and you have one little muffin top and you feel how it feel okay people need to understand that you wanting to do surgery some people do have low self-esteem but not all like for me i'm about woman and i'm about woman with confidence like those high five so if you decide that you're there's something that you want to change about your body you go right ahead and do it because the same way to me, you going into the gym, you going into the gym to lose weight, it's still altering your damn body. It's still changing your body, you know? And a lot of these people, sweetheart, who you see in the gym, squat life, ab life, da 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 they had procedures done also, you know? So people need, like, I've had a lot of people who tell me, you know, my family don't support me and this and that, da da da, da. Listen, if you decide you want to be a surgeon, you go right ahead and be a surgeon. Because of the day, like two to three weeks after your surgery, and you put on that thong with a nice bra, the feeling what you get, you probably walk out of the house, <laughs> you know, the panty and bra not even realize. Like for me, when I did, I bought a thong swimsuit and I went to Dream Weekend and all of my swimsuits were thong for the five days. That's what I did, you know? You need to understand that this is your life and whatever makes you feel better about yourself, you go ahead and do it. What you need to understand is that a lot of people walk around zine with things that they wanted to do, but it's either they're too old, they didn't get a chance to do it, or they have they don't have the heart to do it. So you see when they see somebody getting up and living their lives and doing what they wanted to do, they try to come with their negativity. And that's why for me personally, I told you guys in prior videos I don't really keep friends because the negativity thing and the naysayers and the no one I can it does not I don't allow it in my life and probably that's why God has blessed me so much you know so yes that's definitely something that I wanted to talk about you know like yeah so again the next video will be single in, being single in holiday season. And then this video was just a big, 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 big up to all of them. Big up yourself. I'll see you in the next video.